This horsehead nebula image is my latest result of the Raspberry Pi's HQ camera. Likewise my previous videos. I used a camera lens and H-alpha filter. This time I tried it under the full moon. The photographic conditions are the following. Lens focal length is 85 mm. Lens F value is 1.8. Camera ISO is equivalent to 800. Exposure time is 16 seconds. Number of stacking is 64. The hardware I used are these. Raspberry Pi 4 with LCD in a box. HQ camera via HDMI cable extension. EF85 F1.8. H-alpha filter. Equatorial mount. The software I used consists of these components. Python. OpenCV. Tkinter. Raspastil. DC-RAW. Double buffer scheme. Image processing in floating point arrays. Tone stretching with a lookup table. Separate software to reapply a lookup table. GIMP and RAW therapy in Windows 10. Okay let's go on to the main part of this video. Once again it was a night under a full moon. I was going to use the H-alpha filter to reduce the light pollution. But I was not sure how effective it is to reduce the moonlight. Stellarium shows the location of the Orion and the moon. The moon age was 15.5 to be exact so the full moon was the night before. The Horsehead Nebula is here on Orion's belt. This is the screen capture of my Raspberry Pi operation recorded by Kazam. The number of stack is set to 64. Without retouching later on, 32 might be sufficient or even 16 will be decent. I have tried to capture the Horsehead Nebula since last year and here are the images. The first trial was done using the Python PyCam module. Apparently the exposure is too short and the bit depth of PyCam module is 8 bits. The next trial was done using the Raspastil command and DC-RAW to get the raw data. It looks good enough. This time I carefully adjusted the focus so the image is a bit sharper than the previous trial. Next let's see the comparisons to the images taken with APS-C cameras. Here is my old image taken with my Fujifilm XE1 and 100mm diameter Newtonian telescope. Comparing my Raspberry Pi's image to this image might not be fair. Because it was almost perfect sky condition. Say. No light pollution. This is an image taken using NEX5 with an H-alpha filter. The camera sensor is modified. The IR cut filter is removed. The telescope is the Newtonian that I mentioned. The light pollution condition is the same. The photographic conditions are comparable. The Newtonian telescope's F number is 6 so it's like 3 steps down. So the ISO is 6400 instead to make it 3 steps up. The exposure time is 15 seconds and the number of stacking is 65. Focal length is 900 mm equivalent of a full-frame camera. The Raspberry Pi HQ camera's equivalent focal length is about 500 mm. So the field of view is wider as you can see. The images are at the same level, I'd say. So HQ camera has a high potential to nebulae photography. That's all for this time. I will upload more videos whenever I get a new result or a new insight. Thank you very much for watching this video. See you next time.